Well, it's that time of the year again, and we're gonna talk about best of 2022 for laptops. It's been a long and hectic year, and we have definitely taken a look at quite a number of laptops, anything ranging from the tin and lights all the way to the gaming behemoths. But of course, we aren't going to dive into each and every laptop that we've reviewed thus far because, well, it's going to be quite the long list. So if you're interested in any of those individual reviews, do check out our channel by clicking on, well, our channel and checking out those videos. But without further ado, let's talk about our best of 2022 for laptops. So first up, we have to talk about gaming, and that would mean gaming laptops. Gaming laptops are becoming more and more popular nowadays, and it's not unsurprising thanks to Intel, AMD, and Nvidia. They are really pushing the limits to what they can do, and gaming laptops are just becoming more and more powerful and really comparable to their desktop counterparts. So, our pick for the laptop that takes the gaming spot this year goes to, well, the Lenovo Legion 5i Pro. And perhaps most of you already saw this coming from a mile away, especially since, well, the previous generation Legion was our winner for the best of 2021. So, it goes without saying that this year, well, there's really not much to say. Lenovo has done it yet again. They've really gotten everything just right. We have to give credit where credit's due. It offers great performance, a nice display, plenty of ports, so on and so forth. But yet, it does all that at a price that's just really too good to pass up. Thus, that's our choice. But of course, we do also want to give an honourable mention to the Acer Predator Triton 300 SE. This is a laptop that we reviewed much more recently, and just like the Legion, it basically ticks all the boxes except in a smaller form factor. If you want a more compact yet still high-performing laptop without breaking the bank, this is a good option too. Gaming aside, productivity is a pretty important aspect as well, and we've taken a look at quite a number of productivity-based laptops this year. So, let's talk about our best productivity laptop. Our pick for the best productivity laptop has to go to the MSI Creator Z16P. Honestly, this was a pretty tough decision, but ultimately, we felt that the Creator Z16P was the right pick. Not only does it provide great performance and a splendid display, two factors which are essential for productivity, every other component performs splendidly as well. Not to mention, it does have an SD card reader which really can't be taken for granted. As for our honourable mention, well, that will have to go to the Gigabyte Aero 16 OLED. And with that, you kind of understand why it was such a tough decision. The MSI just aged out slightly with a better port selection and a better keyboard, but again, the Gigabyte will also be just as fantastic. Though do note that either of them might run your wallet dry for a couple of months. Now let's talk about laptops that fit every need, the everyday kind of laptop. I think that this might just be even more obvious. Our pick for the best everyday laptop has got to go to the Apple MacBook Air M2. It really is a no-brainer here because honestly, we were blown away by how good it is. Iconic design, lovely display, great performance, and perhaps the best battery life yet. Our honorable mention will then have to go to the ASUS ZenBook S13 OLED. This is one impressive laptop, and if you've yet to check out our review on it, go ahead, watch it. AMD is really killing it lately, and this pairing with ASUS just makes it downright great. But what if you want something more, something a little fancier? Well, let's talk about premium laptops. When you think premium, you might think that price is the major driving factor. And to a certain degree, yes, price is a factor of it, but it doesn't tell the whole story. In our opinion, the overall experience that you get with a laptop is much more important. So, our pick for the best premium laptop for 2022, well, that goes to the Acer Swift Edge. This is one heck of a laptop and it impressed us in more ways than one. The fact that it weighs just next to nothing despite being a 16-inch device, it has a beautiful 16-inch OLED display that's just stunning, but yet still providing superb performance thanks to AMD Ryzen and at a pricing that isn't too bad either. This might just also be one of my personal favourites among the rest, 
it's really that good. But of course, we do also have an honorable mention and what else but the LG Gram 16. We actually checked out both the standard and the 2-in-1 versions of the Gram and both were pretty impressive. Lightweight, good performance, great display, insane battery life to name a few. While it doesn't feel as premium as the Swift Edge, the Grams are still impressively good. If premium laptops aren't really within your reach, however, well, let's just shift our focus. Now, we're going to talk about value-oriented laptops. Our pick for the best value laptop for 2022 has to go to the ASUS ZenBook 14 OLED. And heck, that very word value is right in the title of our review. At the price that it's going for nowadays, it's insane that you get that much performance in a laptop with an OLED display no less. It's also professional looking and relatively lightweight, which makes it easy to bring around anywhere you go. But again, for the price, it's really mind blowing. And thus, this is our choice. As for our honorable mention, that will have to go to the HP Victus 16. Now you might be thinking it's quite the stark difference from the ZenBook 14 OLED, and you'll be right. But the Victus 16 does strike a sweet spot especially when you're looking at gaming performance. Again, just great value for what it's bringing to the table and thus, that's our honourable mention. And that's it, 5 categories for this year, and the following are all our winners. The Lenovo Legion 5i Pro for gaming, the MSI Creator Z16P for productivity, the Apple MacBook Air M2 for everyday, the Acer Swift Edge for some premium flair, and the Asus ZenBook 14 OLED for downright value. Now, all these were handpicked by us, and these are all laptops that we've reviewed before. So if you're wondering why certain laptops didn't make the list, well, they either didn't make the cut, or perhaps more importantly, we have yet to review them. So there's that. In any case, if you have any questions, definitely leave them in the comments down below. And if you like what we do, go ahead and give this video a like and subscribe to us for more of such content. And honestly speaking, we had quite a lot of fun doing this, so hopefully we can do much more in the future. Here's towards 2023. Till then, see ya!